today we are going to discuss an interesting trick to memorize the image formation in convex lenses before starting our discussion i just remind you to subscribe my channel and press the bell button most of the students facing problems for memorizing Uh, the image formation in convex lenses that means if the object are in different positions the image is formed in different positions for us we really confused when we memorize the position of the image corresponding to different positions of the object for that we just consider a convex lens and we mark the position of the pole focus center of curvature and all here we are placing the object at different positions for that we just mark different positions uh, here the first point is taken as infinity so for infinity we mark 1 then the next point is beyond c i mark beyond c as 2 our next point is 3 which is marked in center of curvature c and in between c and f we mark as point 4 then on focus we mark 5 between focus and pole we mark 6 so we get six numbers now from uh, infinity taken as 1 beyond c taken as 2 center of curvature as 3 between center of curvature and focus as 4 in focus it is 5 between focus and pole it is 6 in the other side also you can mark like that that means the at infinity we take 1 and beyond c we take 2 then on center of curvature we take 3 between center of curvature and focus we take 4 then at focus we choose 5 then between focus and pole we choose 6 just listen our wonderful trick starts now for that we remember an equation the equation is 6 minus position of the object is equal to position of the image now we are checking the our equation for different positions of the object for that i first take position 1 that means beyond that means at infinity our equation is 6 minus position of the object that means 6 minus 1 we get 5 what is the position of 5 it is focus that means we get the position of the image at focus when the object is at infinity don't skip now because there is a suspense in the last there is a special case is in the climax so just be patient next we keep our object position at 2 then 6 minus 2 4 we get that means the position of the image is in between focus and center of curvature on the other side next Uh, we keep the position of the uh, object at c that means center of curvature the point is 3 there and we get the position of the image at c that means at center of curvature itself next we want to choose the position of the object as in between c and f in that case our number is 4 we take 6 minus 4 there we get 2 then our uh, position of the image is 
into that means beyond c okay then we next we take the number as 5 then 6 minus 5 is 1 and we get in the focus we get the position of the image is at infinity next is our climax okay just listen uh, at 6 that means in between focus and pole we get 6 minus 6 is 0 okay always remember if we get a 0 then the position of the image is in the side of the object in this case the position of the image is in the same side of the object and it is in between c and f that means at 4 always remember that twist you can use this method for solving numericals and fixing multiple choice questions and you can use this idea while drawing ray diagrams also okay if you like this video then subscribe my channel and press the bell button thank you very much